Just over 20 seconds left on this man advantage. The centering feed doesn't get into the front of the net, and Valiev advances it to Robinson, who delivers a huge blow on the far side. Now it's an odd man rush for Stockton. Short handed up to Gray that comes in on the forehand, and he scores! Tyler Gray that scores against his former team once again. It's goals in three straight for 44 in red, and the Heat lead one to nothing. Well, off for the transfer eligibility, and then played his final two years as a member of Minnesota Gophers. A chance now for Peluso the other way, and it's shipped ahead. It might be two on one for Iowa if they hurry. Coming in far side, they backhand it across. What a play from Valley of the lone defenseman back for Stockton to break up the chance. And now a shot from the point, and they score. The hero from last night's game, Belpedio, with a slapper from the left point to beat Parsons. Belpedio. Belpedio has two of his three goals this year in this weekend series. Now Fu, he chips it, hits a deflection. Can it be kept in by Grayback? A nice play. Now down low to Dubé coming in on the backhand. What tiptoe passing. And Spencer Fu scores. A beautiful power play. Goal set up by Tyler Grayevic. And there to cap it off is Spencer Fu, who gets stocked in back in the lead with a power play goal. From the Russian. Grayevic pushes the puck ahead on the faceoff loss. A minute, 10 left. Drop pass executed. Dangling through the neutral zone. Robinson now touches it ahead. Grayevic, a partial breakaway. Tyler Grayevic coming in all alone. Grayevic, he scores! Tyler Grayevic, his second goal of the night. And it's a three-point performance for Grayevic. And the Heat extend their lead to two. Welcome back to Des Moines, Iowa. Tyler active stick as that puck stays out wide. Healy in the defensive end for the Heat. He turns the puck over. Now Pollock advances it up the far side boards. Phillips in on the forecheck after the loose puck. Hammond out of his goal. He's vacant. He throws to Pollock and they score. Phillips to Pollock and Stockton. They lead 4-1. to one. A three-goal margin for the visitors. Hammond aggressively came out of his goal. And that opened up the creativity book for the rookie forward Matthew Phillips. Impressive. One minute remaining in the period here at the Wells Fargo Arena. Be sure to stay tuned for the Chase Chevrolet big moment of the game as we give away a Mike McMurtry puck. Puck goes into the empty net from long distance and they score and it's Tyler Grayevic. He gets it into the empty net and it's a hat trick. I believe that should go.